Uh, I'd say chess is way, way too stressful. Um, I don't know why I do it, but okay, I still, I still enjoy it. It's, it's a love-hate type of thing. I'm Eric Hansen. Uh, I'm 20 years old. I currently go to school in Dallas, Texas on a chess scholarship, and I'm from Calgary, Alberta. My friends call me uh, Hansenator. It's kind of, I don't know how it came, but it's like Terminator in my last name, and it has to do with my chess. Um, I'd say my chess is like electronic dance music. It's uh, pretty fast paced, pretty hyper, pretty crazy. Just overall, uh, upbeat, upbeat games and uh, a lot of a lot of action go going on. When I don't play chess during a tournament, uh, I'm either at the gym, hanging out um, at a restaurant or a bar, or uh, maybe like watching a movie in my room. Uh, when I play stronger opponents, I get way too nervous. Um, but at the same time, I get really excited because it's exactly why I play most tournaments is to get better and play strong opponents. I was just very nervous. I mean, beside me are 2750s. They're walking by my door, giving me bad looks <laughs> for spending so much time in a normal opening. There's, you know, top players in the world just walking beside. Like it's just a very cool atmosphere. For I mean, you know, in Canada, we don't have that, and that's one of the reasons why you know it's fun to play chess. You can travel see all these things you, you wouldn't be able to do. And chess is different in different countries, so it's nice to, to see the different chess culture. When I win, uh, my friends know that I usually start getting mad at myself and uh, bugging everyone because I should be happy after a game, but I'm never actually satisfied. So normally I just start complaining about my chess right after I win. When I lose, um, I'm usually pretty okay. I'm like, I'm, I'll usually hold it inside, but uh, after about like an hour or two, I, I, I do something that takes my mind off it and, and I feel better. My opponents are saying about me that um, I play pretty, pretty good in time trouble. Um, sometimes I think way too long on some moves and uh, I play pretty, pretty aggressively. I think he could adapt to whoever he's playing that way. So it, I don't think I could label him as either more of a positional or a more tactical player. Eric's? just a very strong player. Um, between playing him, listening to his lecture, and uh, reviewing my game with him, he gave me a lot of new insights that I didn't previously have, so that just explains uh, how he goes about analyzing what he'll look at that the run of the mill master won't do. So yeah, it was uh, quite a privilege to have him to, to hear his insights on that and have him in Victoria. I'm sure in Istanbul we'll we'll probably pull off a couple upsets and and ha have a pretty interesting tournament. At least a very good experience in the long run for us to play against the, the strong opposition that we can't get in Canada.